Hi beauties, it's Mika. Welcome back to my channel. So today I have a tutorial for you guys on this soft pink romantic eye look. Um, I did this look on Valentine's Day with a date night with my hubby and I loved it so much that I decided to recreate it for you guys. So I hope you enjoy. All right, you guys, so let's get started. First, I'm going to prime my eye with this Makeup Beauty eye primer that I got in an Ipsy bag. And then I'm gonna grab my Amrezy palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills, and I'm gonna go in with a fluffy brush into the shade Caramel, and I'm going to apply this to my eye as my transition. Using the same palette, I'm going to go in with the shade Morocco and apply this right underneath the caramel shade. And then I'm going to pick up this sleek makeup um, matte palette and I'm gonna pick up this kind of burgundy-ish shade and apply this directly into my crease. And then I'm gonna make sure I blend everything well together so it transitions smoothly. With a clean brush, I'm taking this SL Miss Glam brush and I'm just going to um, blend out my crease a little bit more just to make sure everything is diffused. And then I'm going to take this Too Faced Glitter Glue, which I am obsessed with, and I'm going to go in with this Makeup Geek Pigment. Um, I'm not sure what the shade is. I'll leave it down below. And then I'm also going to um, make it damp with some MAC Fix Plus to kind of intensify the color, and I'm going to apply this all over my lid. And then... And then I'm going to go in with the shade Deep Plum from the Amrezy palette as well. And I'm going to apply this into my outer corner and into my crease to um, create some depth and dimension. Next, I'm going to go in with this Urban Decay shadow in the shade Space Cowboy. I featured this in my January favorites, I believe. And this is just a very pretty white gold iridescent shimmer. And I'm going to apply this right on top of that pink shade that I placed on my lid. And then I'm going to go in with my NYC Liquid Liner. It is my absolutely favorite liner. I love this stuff. And I'm going to create a nice wing and line my eyes. Now it's time for mascara and lashes. I'm going to add a light coat of this Tarte Lights Camera Flashes, and then I'm gonna go in with these SL Miss Glam Beauty Seduced Glam Lashes. I am obsessed with these lashes right now at the moment. The band is super thin, very easy to apply. They create the perfect amount of drama, as well as them being very flirty, and they're just so gorgeous. I'm obsessed with them. If you have not tried them out, please do. I'll leave a link down below. And then I'm going to smoke out my lower lash line with the pink shade, again with that maroon burgundy shade from the Sleek um, palette, and then also with Morocco underneath. And there is the finished eye look, now on to the face. So I'm going to use my Holy Grail Primer. It is the Hourglass Mineral Veil Primer. If you guys are oily, I highly, highly suggest this primer. It is a bit pricey, but oh my goodness, it does an amazing job. And then I'm going to cover up my acne spots with this Makeup Forever Concealer Palette. And then I'm gonna go with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Concealer and um, kind of just conceal all of my blemishes. The combination of these two together creates a nice canvas for my foundation. And then I'm gonna go in with the NARS um, All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation. I did do a first impressions review on this foundation. I will leave that linked below, but I am absolutely loving this. Luminous kind of scares me, but this foundation provides just the right amount of luminosity without um, me looking oily and I'm just I love it and then I'm gonna go with the LA girl um, concealer and just conceal under my eyes mixed in with the Mac prep and prime highlight in the shade bright forecast A 
after everything is blended, I'm going to take my SL Miss Glam blush brush and the NARS Light Reflecting Loose Setting Powder, and I'm going to set my under eye. You guys know I love this stuff. I've talked about it so many times. It just blurs out any imperfection and smooths. And then I'm going to take my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Medium Deep, and I'm going to set my entire face. And then for blush, I'm going in with the NARS Exhibit A Blush. It looks very scary in the pan, but it looks beautiful on us women of color. For a highlight, I'm going in with the Christian Dior Amber Diamond Highlighter. I'm going to apply this to the high points of my cheeks. And then for liner, I'm going to line my lips with this NYX liner in the shade Nude Pink. And then for lipstick, I'm going to be mixing two the Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipsticks in the shade Vamp mixed with Pure Hollywood. Alright you guys, and this is the final look. Alright you guys, so that is it for today's tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And make sure you subscribe before you go so that you know when I upload videos. Also, follow me on my social media because I am very active with you guys there. And until next time, I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.